There are several factors that can cause a Galaxy Z Flip 4 to get stuck on a black screen and won't turn on. It can be due to a software glitch, drain battery, or even a hardware issue. In this video, we will show you how to fix a Galaxy Z Flip 4 that won't turn on or respond. But before we move on, please share and like our video so we can help other users who might have this problem. Now going back to our topic, here's what you should do to fix the problem. First solution, try doing the forced restart. One of the common causes of this black screen of death is a firmware crash. The phone will not respond for no apparent reason and will usually just show a black screen. The fastest way to fix this problem is by doing a forced restart. It's a simulated battery removal that refreshes your phone's memory. To do that, simultaneously press and hold the power key and volume down button on the right edge for approximately 10 seconds. When the device shows the Samsung logo, then that's the time to release the keys. The logo is a sign that you've successfully made your Galaxy Z Flip 4 respond again. And in most cases, it's enough to fix a problem like this. However, if it is still stuck and won't turn on, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, charge the battery and do the forced restart. There's a possibility that the battery life of your Galaxy Z Flip 4 smartphone is fully drained. When this happens, your phone will not be getting any power and all you can see is a black screen. So follow these simple steps. Plug the power adapter to a working electrical outlet. Use the original charging cable to connect your Galaxy Z Flip 4 to the charger. Regardless of whether the charging sign shows or not, leave the phone connected to the charger for at least 10 minutes. After such time and with the phone still connected to the power adapter, press and hold the volume down button and the power key for 10 seconds. Your phone should now be able to start normally if the issue is caused by a drained battery or a firmware crash. You might have to do these procedures a few more times if your device refuses to respond. However, after a few tries and it just won't turn on, then have the device checked. The problem can already be with the hardware. We hope this guide can help you one way or the other. Thanks for watching.